welcome back to the channel guys it is me 8744 so today guys i want to talk to you guys about this european super league so guys european super league is back um we've got some new deals listed today and today i want to discuss with you guys how do i feel about this format what is the format and exactly how i feel this will be a short video guys around five minutes and i want to know what you guys think in the comments below because please guys i want you guys to comment down below and maybe i'll do a poll on my twitter and my community tab about the european super league are you guys for it or are you guys against it now, before I start with this, let me just make this clear. The European Super League will re not replace the domestic leagues. So the EPL will still continue, La Liga will still continue, um, Serie A, La Liga, you know, etc. All the leagues will continue. That's, I believe, is a common misconception. A lot of people think all oh, the Super Leagues will replace everything, right? What it's going to do is basically replace the Champions League. It's going to basically replace the European competitions that we know, right? So, let's go ahead and read what it says here on Fabrizio Romano. So, it says Super League potential format announced. There will be 64 teams, three divisions, star, gold, and blue, with promotions and relegations. I'm assuming they're having three divisions, kind of like what how we're having three European competitions, like, you know, the Champions League, Europa League, Conference League. There will be 14 games each season per team, seven at home, seven away. There will be an open competition, two phases, league, and playoffs. So, let me just start off in saying this right here, that this format doesn't sound too bad i'm not it doesn't sound that bad now in an ideal scenario i would still prefer the current edition of the champions league i'd still think the current edition of the champions league is good you know three games at home three games away now if it's between this or the new super league format i'm sorry the new champions league format which is like a swiss format basically i'm taking this one all day this one for me is at least more fair and i think this one's more interesting right because my issue with the other format is that there's no relegation. There is no relegation with the other format. As well as the fact that I feel like for me, it's too much. Like, they're going to have to play 10 games. Right? Um, whereas this one is 14. And 10 is just a group stage alone. Right? So I just feel like for me, this one's a lot more interesting. I think this one's better in that sense. I mean, my preferred scenario would be the, um, what is it called? The original Champions League format. But obviously, that's not going to happen. It's it's either this or the, the Swiss League. And I'm, I'm, I'm saying this right now, Super League is better, you know? And so earlier today, the court ruled in favor that Barca and Real Madrid, they can create their own competition. They can legally do this. So we had this argument, could they do this legally or not? And today, they all ruled that they can do this. A lot of clubs, though, have rejected the idea of joining the Super League. I think all the English Premier League clubs, uh, Villarreal rejected, Real Sociedad rejected, Basically, all the clubs have rejected. I think the only top clubs that have confirmed so far is Barca, Real Madrid, and I think Juventus. I think Juventus. So, really, it's going to be interesting to see how this one pans out. Because, in my personal opinion, it's going to happen. It's going to happen some way or another, and it's going to take place, right? Now, whether this will actually happen or not, I don't know. I, I don't know how soon it will be, but I'm sure it will happen at some point. Maybe not now. But in a few years' time, it will happen. Because football is changing. Football is evolving, you know. And one of the things I like about the Super League that I don't like about the new, the Champions League format is that the clubs don't get a lot of money for it. The revenue is very, very bad. Most of the revenue is with UEFA, right? And with this p format, every club gets this good amount of revenue. You know, especially the likes of Barca Real Madrid. They have been financially in a burden for the last couple of years. And this will be a great opportunity for them to finally compete, Right? And Europe, because let's be real, guys. The Premier League teams have too much money. The Premier League teams have way too much money, and it's simply unfair for the other leagues that we can't compete with the money that they can have. I mean, the likes of Aston Villa can take off, can take away Villarreal's best players, right? And with this format, it would make everything fair. Everyone get a good amount of money, and I think this is good. So for me, at this current moment, I am in favor of the Super League. Um, you know. And I do think the Super League is good. Now, I do think there should be some modifications because I'm not really a huge fan of Florentino Perez owning this. I think that's a bit, um, you know, a bit um, shady in that regard. But I think if they could, like, um, you know, um, like, I think this could be good, guys. This could be good. But we'll see if this actually happens or not, you know. And so at this moment, guys, I am in favor of the Super League. And let's see if this actually takes place or not. So I want to know what you guys think in the comments below, guys. This is definitely a very uh, controversial subject. And I'm sure that... Uh, I might get a lot of dislikes for saying the stuff I am saying, but um, you know, if you if you genuinely feel free, if you genuinely did dislike it, dislike it. You know, I'm not gonna stop you. If you did enjoy this though, please like this video. If that does help the channel grow, 
subscribe to the channel if you're new out here and we'll definitely have more of an in-depth discussion maybe when we have all the details announced and um i'm planning on maybe discussing this more in depth for our members so if you're a member uh we'll probably discuss this more in depth tomorrow's stream so uh feel free to click that join button to um to, to join our discussion tomorrow because i'm sure we'll probably discuss about this tomorrow so like i said guys remember guys to like and subscribe make sure you guys comment to thoughts comes through below, below and uh, subscribe to get notified uh and yeah that's gonna be it guys see you guys later man peace out